A Louisiana tech whiz kid may have a solution to the nation's fuel crisis, and his studies could bring a big boost to the, to the local economy. NBC 10's Brandon Thompson reports. So, oh, it's a rush. I'm not going to lie. Um, everything goes, everything's been going really fast. Really fast because Joshua Brown, the first graduate of Louisiana Tech's nanosystems engineering program, has developed a plan to both produce cheaper, cleaner gasoline and create jobs for the area, all at the age of 23. That was a big passion of mine, um, was to produce a cleaner fuel source because I know we're going to go to hydrogen and solar energy eventually, but the technology is just not mature yet. Brown has developed a chemical reactor to turn natural resources like wood and coal into gasoline, and he wants it manufactured in Ruston. He says that his reactor, unlike others, can be cheaply and easily mass-produced, an innovation that has already gotten the attention of fuel corporations. Ultimately, or it's carried us so far to a license agreement with the Royals Renewable Fuels out of South Louisiana. Uh, they've licensed it. They want to start using it to turn wood chips into diesel. Research in the field of nanotechnology is being used to develop anything from a longer lasting bubble gum to better ways of treating cancer. But Brown hopes that one day his work will be used to make the United States completely energy independent. I always joke around with people. I say uh, that I, I want my kids to ask me what was OPEC. Not what is OPEC, but what was OPEC. Brandon Thompson, NBC 10 News.